jumped down in DC, took an hour and a half, and got off a mile away from the hotel. Got in a cab, and here took less than two hours. And here you are, a new team, a new yeah. practice. And yeah, it's crazy. I mean, you don't really you get put on waivers. You don't really. I don't think you want to get your hopes up too high because most of the time guys are sneaking through. But very fa thankful that the Blue Jackets picked me up, and I'm excited for the opportunity. What does the opportunity mean to you? I mean, it means everything. I've grinded my whole career to get to the point where I can kind of be considered a, an everyday NHL guy, and I think um, you know this is just another opportunity, another chance to prove that. Torts likes to have uh, the engine of his offense come from the blue line. What does that mean to you, and, and how do you fit in with that? Yeah, I think it's important. I mean, I think maybe my biggest asset is probably my skating, and I think that that can kind of kind of help any team. You get back put quick for pucks, get it moving north, and you know you're able to support the play and have tight gaps. So I'm I'm excited to see how I fit in with the system. Is it nice to come here too with Brad Shaw being on this bench, a guy you played for in St. Louis? Yeah, I mean, I didn't have the opportunity to play a ton with Shazi, but we actually worked together quite a bit. I was there for just over a month or so, and we spent a decent amount of time together. So, yeah, I was definitely excited, and I think, you know, he's a well respected coach around the league. I'm excited to work with him again. A lot of systems around the league are generally the same, but then there's little tweaks in there. I mean, how much of a crash course are you going to have to go through to kind of learn what they uh, do? Here? I think there's little things that. I'm sure the coaches will go with me, but uh, go over with me. But for the most part, I mean, it's hockey. I think that you know a lot of it comes down to just winning those little battles, and you know, all competing guys out there. And I hope uh, hope we get the chance to do that. Well, yeah. and on that, you and Brad spent a long time out there just chatting, talking. What's the nature of that conversation? Yeah, you know, we weren't even necessarily talking all hockey, just kind of catching up. You know, a lot's changed in both of our lives since we last worked together. So you know, he's asking about. Now I'm married now, and I got a two-year-old boy, so that all happened since I knew him last. We were chatting about that, and just, I'm just excited. I mean, he's a he's a hockey guy. I'm a hockey guy. We both love the game, and I think that you know, I have a lot in common in that way.